What's up guys and welcome back to some more Dead by Daylight. Today, continuing on in our series of the Seven Deadly Sins, we've got the trickster as Lust. Because I thought that would be perfect because he's weirdly not very clothed. Anyways, he does have like a Cupid skin, but I, I didn't super love it. This one I like a lot more because it's got like the roses and stuff. And then the barbed wire for people who like that kind of thing. I don't know. Anyways, so we've got Lust. Now for this, we're mostly going to be focusing on the obsession, our lust for them. We've got Beast of Prey to start out our build, mostly because it just says your lust for a kill is so intense. Uh, this just makes it so we get 50% more blood points. Um, in the hunter category, and when we are in a chase, once we reach Bloodlust Tier 1, we become undetectable. Until we lose Bloodlust. And then we've got Dark Devotion. So this will make it when we hit our obsession. Oh, just when uh, when they lose a health state. I thought we had to hit them. So even if we get them with our knives, they will get our Terror Radius, and we will be undetectable for 30 seconds. Then we've got Dying Light. So the Obsession is going to get a 33% action sp speed bonus to unhooking and healing of the survivors. Each time we hook a survivor that's not the Obsession, if the Obsession is alive, we get a token. And each token does a 3% penalty to repair, healing, and sabotage for everyone else. And then Friends Till the End. So we become obsessed with one survivor, obviously. When we hook a survivor that's not the obsession, the obsession becomes exposed for 20 seconds and we can see them for 10 seconds. When we do hook the obsession, another random survivor screams and reveals their position and then they become the obsession. Then we've got a bloody boa because boas are sexual, I think. And then caged heart shoes because I thought that was fitting. And then a charred wedding photograph because why not? So if you guys have a build you think would work better, let me know down in the comments below. Maybe give it a try. But, uh, yeah, let's hop in. So last we had played, I do believe we were on a little bit of a winning streak. So, we'll see how this goes. Okay, where are you, my lovely, lovely people? Also, Lara Croft just came out, and I have not actually seen her perks. I don't know what they do. So there's actually a portion of this that's going to be kind of blind, which I'm excited for. I can't shoot. I guess shoot's the wrong word. This is unfortunate. Man, why do I just feel like blind? Like my eyes are not following her as they normally would. Now watch this. That didn't work at all. Well, that was unfortunate. <laughs> Dang it. I need my eyes to focus. There we go. So I don't have a terror radius right now, but I do think I might be able to get this guy down. Well, you know, at least I got it down. I was going to try to go in the basement, but I was not right where I thought I was. I didn't have a chance of... Leon is the... Well... Hey, buddy. So 
so badly wish I could like hit people. Can I make it? Awesome. Why are we so oh, that's why. Ah, that was good. This is not going well for me. Lara. I, I, all over the place. No way that hit her. Should have just kept doing that. There we go. Well, here's my second hook while they've done three gens. Cool. Slightly given up. Were you injured? No idea what just happened. I swear, if I somehow pull this back, I'm gonna laugh. I know David's back here. Hey, buddy. Oh my gosh. This can't happen, right? Where's Lara? Thought I'd catch her slacking. What are you up with? I could go over there and try to get her. Now that I kind of know the direction she's at. But, eh. Hoping it takes him a second reset. No, you can't help. I really wish I could aim better. Like, I gotta say, that would make things a lot easier. He's right next to me. Unless that was me lifting him up that made that sound. Which it may have been. I don't know. Now I'm confused. I really don't know. Let's get this not done. <coughs> I know you're like right here. I don't know why you didn't just use your that to get her. I just want to get her into second stage. Yeah, I knew she was, like, right there. Take it, though. I think he's dead. 
which means I only have two tokens, but the rest of these guys, it's going to take me a second to reset, hopefully. Yes. Oh, cool. We're just going to let this happen. All right. I'm not opposed to this. I'm going to bet that she has stabby McStabs. Okay, I've got a controller, okay? It's a lot harder. No. Decisive strike. That's the word. Hey, baby. Ooh, I'm surprised it let me up there. I wasn't sure it would. Hey, you already used this pallet. Oh, yes. Come right back to where this... Oh, she was. Dang it. She's going to go pick her up. Leave it up. Darn it. Ah, I can't seem to walk straight. I don't think you're getting out of this, girlfriend. She used a syringe. I did think that was on the other side, though. So that's unfortunate. She's going for the revive. And there's Lara. That's unfortunate. Still got you, though. And Lara's over there. Oh, that was convenient of you. Thank you. That was a really good place for you to get down. Hopefully she doesn't have adrenaline, but I'm kind of willing to make she does. So I have got two. Okay. I guess adrenaline wouldn't pick up until I did a gen, or until I closed the hatch. I don't. Nah, I'm not. I'm not chancing that. Not after what a comeback they gave me, where I had two downs and they had three gens done. I should have gone over to Killer Shack first. But I didn't. Oh, she might just die. That's fine. <laughs> you won't see me whine about it. Alright, well that was our Seven Deadly Sins Lust build. If you guys have a build you think it worked better, let me know down in the comments below. I think it worked out pretty good. I I did not expect a snowball like that, so that was convenient. You guys have a game you'd like me to play let me know down in the comments below until now or until next time stay spooky toodles